Hey there, Chris here with 123Muse. Let's take a look at our next widget, which is Screen Orientation Alert. Now this is a mobile specific widget. So we're gonna drag this onto the page and see what it actually does. We can see that we have here um, an orientation. Uh, what do we need? What does that actually mean in real terms? What is this actually doing? Let's take a look at a sample on my phone here. I'm gonna pull up the lime and sugar demo site and we can see here that we're in portrait mode now if we switch to landscape mode we can see that this icon shows up to tell us that we should be in portrait mode so we go to portrait mode and the icon disappears so what this widget is for is to let people know that the best experience they're going to have on this device is going to be in the orientation that we've specified. So going back to the widget here, we can see that which orientation do you need? Do you need portrait or do you need landscape? So obviously if you need portrait, you would choose need portrait. If you want the people to use specify landscape, then you would use landscape. We can choose the icon background color. So we can change that to whatever color we want. So let's say we want it in blue. We can change the icon size and the distance from the top corner and so on. Let's preview this. We would see currently that because we were in the need landscape, we're in landscape mode, so the icon doesn't show. Let's switch to, uh, sorry, portrait mode. Let's switch to landscape mode and we can see there is our icon. Let's make some changes and see how it affects the widget. If we change our corner radius to zero, We'll change our icon size to 30 and we'll change our distance from the corners to zero and let's change that to red. Go back to our preview, refresh and we can see now that it shows neatly up in the corner. So this is a, it's quite a simple little widget but it really does um, add to the mobile user experience to make your Muse site feel more like a native app and feel more like a coded, hand-coded website or a site that was had a lot bigger production value. And all you have to do is drag the widget from the library, configure it, and you're ready to go. So very powerful little widget for creating that user experience. Very easy to use using our ink interface same as our all of our other widgets and um, enjoy using it thanks for watching